Another Sporkle quiz. This one is find the countries of Europe. No outlines. Minefield. Can you click the countries of Europe or the arrows pointing to them without any outlines and without making any mistakes? The quick answer is no, I cannot. Because there are 47 European nations on this map. And I haven't traveled to all of them. I haven't studied, I haven't cared to study uh, Europe very, you know, extensively. Um, but my travels to Europe in 2018 um, have informed me about European history. Um, more so than my education, than my formal education. You know, I was oppressed with the knowledge of European history being so grand and all of this but without a connection to Europe or a uh, an interest really you know because of a connection to Europe uh, yeah it did not resonate with me I was more interested in Africa but I think I am close I'm more closely related to uh, England um, than Africa, or at least I don't know my African ancestry. Um, what I'm saying is my last, what I'm trying to explain is my last name is Wiggs. And I recently learned that um, the last name Wig, W-I-G-G, -G, um, has origins, I, I believe, in um, England, but also in Sweden. And, you know, because I'm an American, and our blood is mixed and all that kind of stuff. I'm saying that I have a clearer idea of. Um, of uh, origin uh, related to Europe than I do of Africa. But that's only because I haven't done African ancestry as of yet. And all of the research I've done at the National Archives in Washington, D.C. And okay, and what I'll say about that is when I went to the National Archives in Washington, D.C., they basically had me just use um, Ancestry.com. I sat at a computer for a couple of hours using Ancestry.com in D.C. So what I would say about um, doing your history is just sit at the computer and access Ancestry.com and don't do like me and um, fly to Washington, D.C. because I just used Ancestry.com at a computer in D.C. and I'm from California. I certainly enjoyed visiting D.C., however, and I definitely went to New York afterwards, but, you know, it is what it is. Um, yeah, so during, during the, um, doing the African, excuse me, during the, doing the Ancestry.com research, I was able to find, um, I can go back to the 1800s, um, in my family and find uh, our history and then there's a, a leap that has to, there, there is no connection to um, an American Revolutionary uh, War hero, um, a General Whig, I believe his name was. They've written books about him and, and everything. Um, but I think that there might be a connection. I think that somehow we, we are probably connected with him because his last name was Whig. And our family name is Wiggs with an S. And what that explains, how I rationalize this is, you see, um, that S in our last name potentially was added to distinguish the African um, and the African descendants uh, from the European descendants. But basically, our ancestors were getting down no matter what just for you follow what I'm saying I mean Thomas Jefferson look at him he had two families one was Sally Hemings and then another white one with whomever was his uh, 
public wife, you know. Yeah, history is interesting, y'all. All right. Okay, so let's let me let me get into this uh European country thingamajig and, and try to figure it out. All right, here we go. Five minutes on the clock, 47 countries, and I will not be finishing this. <laughs> but we'll see. Oh, and I have to identify where it is. This is minefield. Oh, and um, there are no outlines? Yeah, I'm screwed. Germany is somewhere over here. I don't know exactly where that is. Iceland. I think Iceland is here. Greenland, I think, is over here. This is Iceland. Woohoo! I got that right. Liechtenstein. I have no idea where that is. Malta. I think Malta is somewhere over here. Like Cyprus is near there, but I'm not going to risk it. Estonia is somewhere over here. I'm not risking it. Portugal. I know where Portugal is. It's over here. I've been to Portugal. You see? You see how travel informs you? Yeah, dig. I've been there, so I've I've seen it on a map, you know, numerous times while planning my trips, and so it 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 was seared in my brain. Okay, Lithuania, yeah, Lithuania is somewhere over here. Not risking it. Bulgaria, I don't know. Sweden, I've been to Sweden. Like Sweden's over here. Here we go. I'm gonna click it. Yes. Oh, good. It's a large area. You know, but the only area, the only part of Sweden I've been to is either here or it's either over here. I think it's over here. Yeah, but Sweden is so large. And the only people who go up in here are those who are willing to, um, who are going to hunt and do other, you know, outdoorsy out activities. Because that there's just a lot of forest, a lot of snow and other stuff. Andorra. I know where Andorra is, but I'm not going to risk it. I think, let's see, Andorra is between... Spain and France. It's this tiny country on the border, like right there. I know where it is. I can identify. I need more. I need some lines. I need some guidelines. Albania, I have no idea. Slovakia, no idea. Turkey, that's Turkey, right? Turkey's like right here. That's where Turkey is, but again, I'm not going to risk it. The Ukraine is somewhere over here. I'm not risking it. North Macedonia, really? Nope. Vatican City, nope. No, thank you. Belarus, nope. Hungary, nope. Slovenia, Czechia, nope. Excuse me. Finland. I think this is Finland over here. I think so. I'm not going to risk it, though. <laughs> Luxembourg. Austria. Russia. Okay, I think this is Russia. I think I'm 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 good. If I just click over here. Woo! Yeah, all of that's Russia. Good, good, good. Kosovo. Whatever. Croatia. Nope. Norway. Ooh, see, I'm glad I didn't hit Finland because uh I thought Finland was over here, but it could be Norway and then this could be Finland. And see, I I would have made a mistake. This boot, the boot, of course, is Italy. All of that is Italy? Wow. Well, if all of this is Italy, then what is that? Oh, if this is, that must be Vatican City right there. That little arrow there. Okay. Monaco, I don't know. Montenegro, I don't know. Poland, yes. I flew to Poland. I think Poland's right there. Cyprus is this island here. I think it is. I don't want to be wrong, though. But I'm guessing it's that island right there. But it could be this island over here. So I'm not sure. See? Switzerland? Is Switzerland right here where this line is going? It might be. It probably is because it's it's landlocked. And then I think, well, where the heck is Greece? Maybe that's Greece. See, that's why I didn't choose Cyprus because I don't know the difference between Cyprus and Greece. Okay, the Netherlands. I know where the Netherlands are. Somewhere over here. But I'm not going to risk it. I'm running out of time. Serbia, Bosnia, and Herzegovina. Head just get over Okay. United Kingdom is over here. Ireland is here. United Kingdom is here. Scotland and Wales are up north. UK is right there. Latvia. Oh, the United Kingdom included Scotland and Wales and all of that. Okay. That's what the United Kingdom. I was thinking of England. That's what I was thinking of. Latvia. 
San Marino? I don't know. Denmark. Yes, I've been to Denmark. Denmark is here. Copenhagen. Yes. Ireland is here. Moldova. Okay. Belgium is like right here, but I'm not going to risk it. I'm not going to risk messing up. France. Yes, France is like here. Beautiful. Spain, of course. I know where Spain is. Excuse you, clock. Spain is right here. They wouldn't let me do it. Hmm. All right, so I was talking and I was doing this. I'm going to rush through this one more time. So I have an idea where these places are. Let me see if I can do better. Nine. Nine out of 47. Let's see. Yes, I know where Denmark is. Spain. Yes, I do. The Netherlands? Is it up here? Is it down here? I'm not going to risk it. San Marino. Albania. Lithuania. The Ukraine. Croatia, Portugal, yes, Kosovo, Cyprus, Estonia, Belgium, Iceland, United Kingdom, Italy, Czechia, France, Slovenia, Germany, okay, Germany's just got to be all of that over there, Ooh, I could have clicked it here and I would have been wrong. Oh my goodness, see, it's very, very, very scary. Greece is over here somewhere, but Malta, yeah, Montenegro, Norway, uh, I'm not certain. Monaco, Mo Monaco, Moldova, Belarus. All right, we're just going to, I think Turkey is right here because Turkey is connected. Okay, I did it. Good. What is that? The Baltic? I think, what is the Baltic? Sea? Black Sea or something like that? I remember that from my travels there. Okay, Bosnia and Herz Herzegovina. I don't know where it is. Okay, remember, Russia's over there. Bulgaria. Okay, Slovakia. Romania. Latvia. Andorra. All right, that's where it is. Where that is. Good, I got Andorra. Finland. You see, I don't know. I remember Sweden is here. I know Switzerland. All right, France was right here. And I think... I think they're pointing at Switzerland. Oh dear, I just screwed up. I don't understand. Switzerland is right here in this arrow. I thought the arrow... Oh, how could you do that to me? 12. See, I've done better. Only because I rushed this time. Alright, if you're going to stick with me, I'm going to do it right this, this time. So, I'm going to get maybe 15... Maybe 15 this time. San Marino. Like Dan Marino. I wonder if they did that purposely. Dan San Marino. Okay, Greece. I'm not going to risk it. Moldova. Estonia. North Macedonia. Luxembourg. Belarus. Belgium. Screw it. Let's just put it in there. What happened? I clicked this and nothing happened. Oh, whew. Oh, my goodness. Thank goodness. All right. I know where Belgium is. And I just didn't know if I was... See, if I had clicked here, I would I would have been wrong. It's so... It's like nerve-wracking, you know? Monaco. Okay. Malta. I don't know. Bosnia. Nezgeria. Okay. Bulgaria. Czechia. Austria. Kosovo. Denmark. Liechtenstein. Slovenia. Serbia. Romania. Slovakia. Switzerland. Okay. Switzerland is here. The last time I made an error... Because I clicked that arrow. Yes. That was close. I could. I was so close to clicking Italy or some other region over here. My goodness. Spain. The United Kingdom. But I did it well this time. Okay. So I know the Netherlands is north of Belgium. There we go. I know that. I believe this is Vatican City here. Very good. Iceland. The Ukraine is in here somewhere, but we're not going to risk it. Montenegro. Finland. I'm not certain where Finland is. Norway, Finland. I'm, I'm not certain. France is here. Cyprus is over here somewhere. Croatia. Germany. I'm going to guess Germany's here. Whew, okay. Germany's so large that, yes, you have... Uh, you, the. If you click in this area versus this area, you know, it's little, it's forgiving. Larger countries are more forgiving than these tiny 
ones. Hungary, I don't know. Russia, very good. Andorra, yes, we know where Andorra is. Lithuania is over here somewhere, but whatever. Portugal, yes. Norway, I'm not certain. Sweden, of course. See, we're at 14 right now. Albania. Ireland is over here. Italy. Turkey, very good. Poland. Mm. Okay, are Russia and Poland, um, do they border each other? Because if so, then I'm going to click right here. <gasps> I messed up. See? Ah. All right, well, I said I was going to get 15, and I've gotten 17. So that's not bad, right? But then there's so many other countries all in this area. All right, I'm going to end this video here. But uh, that's as best as I'm going to do for now. 36%. Hey, the average score is 24, and I got 36%. You've been studying, haven't you, it says. I've been studying. Eh, not really. I've been traveling. That's what I owe this to. Peace. Oh, yeah, Kobe, let them know. You're at 109 right now. the top of the mountain to see the scene petty wap don't want me to have anything i'm the captain no jet lag yeah. bowing jet swag yeah. floating to the sunset keep the drinks coming back she summoned me gave me turbulence on the sink pretty flight attendant boarding pass i'm a buddy right. 